Hi, I'm Peter Diamandis with your next Abundance Espresso Shot. Today we're going to be talking about disruptive technologies and opportunities for the future. And one that gets me very excited is the whole area of genome sequencing. We're heading towards a period of time where the ability for you as a consumer to sequence anything is coming down. We're going to have these technologies on our cell phones. You know, when Craig Venter in 2000, 2001 sequenced his genome, it cost him about uh, $100 million and took just under a year time. That rate of genome sequencing has plummeted in cost at, you know, I think five times faster than Moore's Law. And I've seen technologies that would allow you to literally sequence, you know, materials, biological materials on your phone. So imagine that you go to the restaurant and you're able to sequence the food you have there to find out, is that fish really cod or is it something else? On the same lines, we're going to start sequencing uh, when, when a person goes and gets a mole removed or has any kind of surgery. You're going to sequence everything to understand what are the genetic changes that are occurring in those particular cells that you took out of the human body. But it goes way beyond that because ultimately, and you know, God knows what the moral implications of this stuff is, I want you to imagine that you're able, if you're an insurance provider, to go into the sewage system and literally sequence the sewage coming out because as we go to the bathroom, we are all sloughing cells and our biological sequence is entering the sewer system where someone could actually go and sequence that information. Now, what would that matter? Well, if I'm an insurance provider and I want to know whether I should insure this particular zip code, I can go and find out, okay, in this particular zip code, the number of people who have a chance at Alzheimer's, who have a chance at cancer, have a chance at some other debilitating disease is lower than this, than this zip code. So I'm gonna insure this area and not the other. So that ability to have that kind of metadata and knowledge from genomics would allow me to get an advantage over a different insurance provider. That's just one example of this brave new universe of knowing anything at any time, anywhere, where we're heading. So just a thought for you on this future of gene sequencing. It's Peter Diamandis with your Abundance Espresso Shot for the day.